So I know that fall fashion can sometimes be a challenge for us curvy ladies, literally finding jackets with arms that fit, boots that can actually fit our calves, or is it just me? <laughs> to find those perfect pieces that flatter our curves and keep us feeling confident, yeah girl, I know the struggle can be real. But fear not, because today I'm here to share the best pieces at Walmart right now. Hi fashionistas, new here, I'm Chi Chi, welcome. Not new here, welcome back. And welcome the new kids. Give them a taste of how we treat family around here. Here, we're all about celebrating style, self-expression, and fabulous fashion. So if you love fashion, beauty, and vlogs, sis, you found your tribe, stay a while. We've got cozy sweaters, stylish jackets, and so much more to get you looking and feeling chic this season. So whether you're curling up with a good book or on your way to pick up your pumpkin spice latte for a day, I've got you covered with the looks. Sis, keep on watching. Before we get into it, let me quickly run you through my outfit of the day. This top right here is from the inn, you know, that place we do not mention on this channel. It's super old, so I'm pretty sure I couldn't link it even if I wanted to. This top is from H&M. This is like their ballet style top, so the back is actually low. They always have these, like, from time to time. So if it's still available, I will definitely look for it and link it. And then I have on some leather shorts. You know how the weather is right now, like, as we're transitioning, it's like, hot and then cold and then hot. Anyway, I love a leather short for that kind of moment. You can always pair it with tights or if it's colder where you're at. And then my usual jewelry, Amazon watch, friendship bracelet. This necklace is from Marie Costello. I believe this might still be in stock, so I'll link it. This is from the waterproof jewelry brand. And what I like about this is that it has this little charm situation happening here. So super easy outfit. Got my goodies out here. So where do we begin? Dresses, outerwear, mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's start with dresses. If you're following me on Instagram, you've probably already seen me share this pieces. Shameless plug, follow me on Instagram. You've probably already seen me share some of these pieces. And if you see me moving around, it's because I got my phone in my hands, okay? Because I don't want to forget something important. The first item I want to start with is this gorgeous baby doll dress. We're talking fall weddings, family photos, date night even. This is perfect for whatever version of fall you're currently experiencing. I know people in the down south, your fall is a lot different from us up north, okay? I love the details on this dress. It has a sweetheart neckline, has this little ruching detail around the bust. It has puff sleeves and even has like some of that ruching detail around the sleeve as well. But the part about this dress that makes it a game changer and a fan favorite is the baby doll bottom, okay? As you can see, this dress floats away from the body so it is not, it's skimming past your curves. You don't need to wear Spanx with this, you don't need to be uncomfortable in this. It literally glides past the belly, past the fupa, etc. etc. I would recommend this type of dress for a pear shaped girl, hourglass shaped girl, a rectangular shaped girl. I'd recommend this dress for most body types, except for someone who carries a lot of weight around the entire circumference of your stomach. So, if your stomach is generally has volume from the top to the bottom, I wouldn't recommend this dress only because I feel like it might lean to looking more of like a maternity piece on you. But if you don't care about that girl, then I don't care about it too. But I just wanted to mention that. Aside from that, this dress is super flattering on most body types and it's like a woven fabric. I don't want to call it lightweight, but I definitely would say it's great for early fall if you're like in the north, but this will also walk you through the entirety of fall if you're down south because it isn't too heavy. So it's a great piece. I also love the print that it comes in. It comes in another print and last I checked, you know, the stock on this was a little limited. So if you want this, it will be linked for you in the description box down below. Scoop this up. Last thing I want to mention, I'm 5'7". I did go ahead and hem this dress a little bit to make it shorter because I thought that made it a little bit more flirty and more date night appropriate. I have it styled three ways. I've styled this with boots. I've styled this with sandals. So again, I even styled this with sneakers. It is that versatile. A must have. 
Now the next outfit is not a dress, it's actually a jumpsuit. This was also pretty low in stock, so again, if you're feeling it, check the links in bio. Hopefully it's still <laughs> available. And y'all, I have no way to control the stock levels, okay? Because y'all been coming for me in the comments, and I'm just trying. This is a team effort here. I can't do it all, I wish I could. If by any chance there is something that isn't linked, just let us know in the comments. As soon as we catch it, we always go through and update the links in the description. We are not trying to hide any links from you, okay? And again, you can always find everything that I share on my Like to Know It. That's actually the first place where I share all of these things because that's what the platform is for. The platform is for sharing things you love so that if other people are interested, they can buy it. And that is why we share it there first, okay? So if you want first dibs, you know what to do. It's always linked in the description box for you. I'm trying, y'all. I promise I'm trying. Look at me. I'm all <laughs> nasally here and I'm still trying to film this video because I do want want you guys to have all the tea okay <laughs> bear with me all right so the jumpsuit loved it it's satin to me this is one of those pieces that's super versatile date night thanksgiving girls night out work anything like it's so versatile and i got it here in the size 2x which is the largest size it came in as you guys can see it was a, it was a little snug okay in the blt area uh, i'm thinking this gotta go back but let me know in the comments if you think i can finesse this i personally don't think i can but let me know in the comments what your thoughts are on this. It also comes in black, I believe, as well. Y'all, so this is definitely one of the ones that I'm on the fence about just because of how it fits around the belly area and it is a little bit snug on the arms as well. But I do love the concept of this. This would be perfect for the holidays if you don't want to wear a dress. Um, so it's you know, it has a lot of potential. It's like cargo style, but like very subtle with the cargo pockets on the thighs and the pockets up top. But yeah, let me know what you think on this one. The next dress I have for you is going to be this green sweater dress. What really drew me to it was the fact that it has this sash in the middle to add a little spice, a little something to the traditional sweater dress. This is another piece that I think you could dress down with some sneakers or dress up with a pair of boots or even like a pump for like a date night or like a Thanksgiving or something along those lines. I think this would be perfect for Thanksgiving just because of the sash because it will help hide the food babies, the apron tummies, the bellies, all the things. If you just have a little bit of pooch, I would recommend this because it'll help to kind of distract from all of that. I'm wearing it here in a 2XL as well. Y'all, it's super soft. Perfect for those crisp days. I love pairing a look like this with over the knee boots. You could do like a snakeskin one, just a simple black one for a chic, effortless look. And we love a one and done outfit. So that is why you always catch me okay with the sweater dress. Is it fall without some knit dresses? So the first knit dress again is great for this transitional season. Again, if you are in the south, this is a sleeveless knit dress. It has this little sporty stripe going with it. So in my opinion, it leans to be more of like a sporty style dress, but you could definitely dress this up with a blazer if you like, styling it with a shacket, okay? To me, this is a super cute outfit to wear to the airport to travel especially if you're going from somewhere like cooler to somewhere warmer love that I have it on here in a 2x and for the most part I am wearing a 2x in everything that you see here or a size 18 20 the only caveat to that is gonna be for bottoms whenever I can find a 3x L, I will get that or XXXL. I know there's a difference between the two. I will get that, but it seems that Walmart may be discontinuing that size. So if you are that size and you have been eyeing some pieces, my suggestion is you rack up because I'm seeing less and less of it on the site. We'll talk about that a little bit later. This dress again, super easy. It's black, wear it so many different ways. And to me, if you're a capsule wardrobe girly, a classic girly, this is a must have. If you need a dress you can wear Thanksgiving, here it is. It floats off the body so you can eat as much as you like without issue. And it's faux leather, so you happen to be like, so it'll keep you nice and warm without overheating. Like, you know, you have those people who do not like to turn on the air. You know you have those people who keep their house frosty. This is the fit to wear, okay? <laughs> Love the details on this one. This little scallop situation and the ruching. It buttons all the way down, it's a shirt dress. It also has this fun little details like here, okay, around the cuff. Now, 
the final dress is going to be a maxi because yes you can wear maxis in the fall I love this one because it has a little cutout on the sides a little peek a boom moment has a deep V all the little details on this just make it super flattering and kind of sexy okay you can lean like family photos but it can also lean date night depending on how you plan to pair it a pair of boots would work perfectly with this and like a trench coat you gotta look if you want to go super fall you could do cowboy boots and a fedora I love the colors in this very western vibes it has like greens and burgundies and black so all of like the very autumnal colors I'm gonna drop a link for this for you as well in my opinion this kind of runs small because I got this in a 2x and it fit a little snug around my BLT so around the hips the apex of your hips like I could feel it pulling a little bit and so I would prefer to size up just so it didn't pull so I just wanted to bear that in mind so if you're a hippie girl I would definitely size up in this dress aside from that it even has like little flecks of metallic thread running through it this dress is a versatile dress this could also easily work for a fall wedding as well it has ruching on the sleeves it has this little fun little sexy cutout detail it's an easy dress to just throw on and go next let's talk about layering okay and can you layer without outerwear no you can't Fall is all about layering and Walmart didn't come to play with the outerwear options. So we've got shackets, okay. My number one find this fall is going to be this leather shacket. To me, it is such a must have. It's a great transitional piece for when we're not quite ready for a heavy leather jacket, but we also can't walk out in the t-shirt, which is like right now. And what I like about it is that it's a classic leather tool. In my opinion, it's not gonna go out of style. Like you can wear this year after year after year. And the best part of all these outerwear finds is that they're all under 50. And y'all know how expensive outerwear can get, okay, in the fall and winter. This one is very much like an oversized shirt, very much shacket style with oversized pockets it's in the front it has real functional buttons so you can button it up and just wear it like a shirt and what I like about it is that you can throw on a t-shirt and some leggings throw this over it some sneakers and you've got to look but you can also throw this over dresses I've been loving pairing it with short things so like skater skirts short dresses this would also be a hit that little juxtaposition of feminine with masculine okay what I like about this jacket is it allows you to create a very stylish yet functional look okay for running errands or even like meeting up with friends and I didn't just get a leather one I also got a denim one this one is like a quilted denim style again if you don't want to throw in like a traditional denim jacket this is also another option for you as well you style it just like the leather jacket similar thing you can wear it with leggings compare with jeans compare with dresses skirts etc etc gives you that extra warm and that extra layer that always looks oh so chic and I love the added detail of the quilting because you know it just adds a little bit of something to the look right and I picked up the jacket in a size 3x because I really wanted super oversized and I picked up the denim jacket in a 2x and low-key if I would do this all over again I probably would go up to a 3x as well again that's only if you wanted to rock it super oversized I did pick up one leather jacket if y'all don't know if nobody has told you about the scoop leather jackets at Walmart run do not walk for something at the price point it's at under 50 the quality is there the leather does not look like super shiny at least in person we got lights going on here so I don't know what y'all are seeing but in person this leather does not look super shiny or like fake or super thin or super like paper baggy and I've seen all kinds of levels of leather jackets and this one is so good for the price okay I'm gonna say the unbeatable price this one is so good and I have it here in a size 2xl which is a size 20 and it fits and it fits comfortably and I decided that brown is having a moment this season is definitely one of the top color trends for the season monochrome and brown so you're doing like different textures from leather to fur to silks etc etc I never thought brown could be chic but actually like a brown silk that hot chocolate color is so sexy anyway 
anyways I digress so I knew brown was hot for the season I didn't necessarily want to invest in a leather brown jacket because again this is very much a trend and I thought for the price of this that this was definitely worth it so if you already have a black leather jacket brown is her softer more feminine sister <laughs> so I'm gonna link this for you guys down below because it's really good I mean look at the detail y'all this does not look like a jacket that is under 50 bucks the next piece of outerwear I picked up is this grandpa sweater. You need a good cardigan for fall, okay? You need a good cardigan year round, especially if you work in an office. But even if you work from home, something to give you all the cozy vibes on those like crisp fall mornings. If you have to run outside to grab your mail or you have to sit in a Zoom call and you woke up a few seconds before you were supposed to be scheduled for your meeting. I love a good grandpa cardigan. This one has a ton of different colors. So there's some white, there's some black, there's even some navy. I love that they did that. Okay, because it really allows you to mix and match it and pair it with different thing and you guys can see it's nice and chunky nice and comfy and I got this in a size extra extra large there is a target haul coming soon I might sneak peek a little bit if not in this video in the next one so that's of course if it's not live Lord so for my babes who love Target I got you too. And then I also picked up a puffer jacket because fall wardrobe, winter wardrobe complete. If you don't have a leather jacket, a puffer jacket, and an oversized cardigan, no. I saw this one from Wally World. Actually, this was not the one I wanted to get. There was another one I wanted to get. It had like a little belt that went with it, but sadly it sold out in my size. So I settled for this one. Love the fact that it has all the camo fun colors, but basically it's a neutral and it's not black, which means I feel like it's a lot more versatile. I can it with different things they also decided to have a little bit of fun by putting this little fuchsia color underneath this but this is like two shots of espresso with you know a pumpkin spice cold foam that's what I think of when I see this puffer jacket throw this over your leggings and your sweatshirt and just running out and running errands it's perfect another practical yet chic outfit that you can wear to run errands or meet up with friends and if you really want to know the difference between looking like put together in your comfies versus looking like slobby it's having these additional teeny pieces that kind of pull the look together a baseball hat a pair of sunglasses puffer vest a jacket that kind of pulls your entire look together and take you from looking like you've rolled out of bed to looking like you actually took some time to put together your outfit. But the truth is you really did just roll out of bed. You just know how to style your pieces now so you always look pulled together. If you've been enjoying the video so far, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. It's just a small way to pay things forward. It actually helps me. Also, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. Continuing on with leather because it seems like I've been on a leather kick. When I saw this pleated leather skirt come in stock, the way I ran and grabbed this thing, again, this is another one of those pieces that had limited stock and limited availability. I'm telling you now, so you don't say, you missed out on it right the way I ran and grabbed this I grabbed it in two colors so I grabbed it in black and I also grabbed it in the brown burgundy colors they look so similar like the browns and the burgundies but I'll say it's gonna be a brown I grabbed it as well I love the length on this it's a like midi love the pleats the quality the price for faux leather can be all over the place like really expensive really outrageous to be able to find a piece like this of this quality of this magnitude of of quality for under $50 is like run do not walk okay I'm, I'm giving you the tea right now and so I got this in a size 20 or extra extra large the waist is a little big for me so I would say that if they don't have your size and you really want this you may be able to get away with a size down now if this this one is from scoop okay this one is very limited in sizing so if this one is sold out they also have a version from eloquent elements I will link that for you down below that is true plus size sizing so whatever size you wear in plus 
that's the size you should get. And it also comes in both colors. It comes in the black. It comes in this brown sort of like chocolatey color. I think the only difference I kind of saw was that this one is slightly longer. So if you are more on the petite side, I would actually recommend that skirt over this skirt. Again, quality, I, I keep saying for the price because because for the price, okay? You easily pay $89.90 on the more affordable sides for a skirt like this. Anyways, it's late. I hope these styling tips have inspired you to get creative with your fall fashion. Remember to share your own styling tips in the comments down below. I love hearing your ideas. Remember, style is all about expressing yourself and feeling confident and comfortable in the skin you're in. I hope you enjoyed discovering all these incredible fall pieces from Walmart as much as I enjoyed it. These pieces right here will definitely be on my rotation for fall. Which piece was your absolute favorite? Let us know in the comments. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Remember that you are fabulous just the way you are and your style should reflect that. Until next time, stay chic and fabulous and don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and share. Stay blessed.